This is part five, the final part of what's on your ballot in Phoenix, Arizona. Let's get into it. Okay, first of all, there is so much information. The more that I looked up, the more I was like, oh my gosh. With that being said, I found two helpful articles to help you complete your ballot that covers the rest of the propositions and also the judges. Okay, here's the first one. The first one is Arizona's 10 ballot propositions, the good, the bad, and the ugly by Blog for Arizona. This is helpful because they have a video summary as well as short synopsis on each of the propositions. I also like the bio of the writer of the article. Um, she sounds like she actually cares about people and I know sometimes that's hard to find. The second article is called What to Know About the 74 Arizona Judges on the 2022 Ballot. Y'all, there are so many freaking judges on the ballot this year. The whole ballot Feels like it's the judges. Now, last time Arizona was voting for judges, my sister sent me this helpful website that had reviews from the public on what they thought about the current judges. We can't seem to find that website, but this article is very helpful because it's pretty clear on who the bad judges are and who the public wants to remove. So if you vote for any of the judges, at least get the bad ones out, right? I found these things to be helpful, but let me know what you guys find. Remember, your vote is your choice. Fill out your ballot as an educated voter and all opinions stated on my own.